Hi everyone and welcome to this video. So today I'm here with another toy tray with my lovely friend in Germany who goes by the name of Nao or Nicole. Um, so yeah, we've done, a, I think we've done two previous trades before. I'll link those videos down below as well as other sort of friend mail uh, sort of things. So Nicole is a very good friend of mine who I met through Instagram. She's absolutely lovely to talk to. We have quite a lot in common and often we just kind of talk about obviously toys or like TV show stuff or kind of like vegan stuff because she's vegan as well. Um, but yeah, she's just an amazing person and it's always so nice doing these trades and gathering stuff. We don't tend to do them so much as surprises because we like to kind of make sure we get stuff, you know, that the other person really wants. And I know, um, you know, Nicole especially, I think she doesn't want to like just buy stuff for the sake of it and just kind of have has quite specific collections, I suppose, quite similar to me. Um, so yeah, it's always quite a planned trade, but it's so awesome, so fun. Um, but yeah, so I've got her package here. I've just opened the top of it for the uh, thumbnail. So let me move some of the packaging out. So this is what it looks like. I see we've got some really yummy snacks on the top. Um, so yeah, so let's just dive straight in. So yeah, all the way from Germany, which is awesome. Um, I sent mine a little bit after hers, but hopefully she'll be getting that very soon. Um, this package literally took like two days. She posted it, I think it was on a Thursday or a Friday. And it was like on the Monday or the Tuesday I got it, like including the weekend, it was just a couple of days. I couldn't believe how quick it was. Um, but anyway, so what I can see first is these. Nicole sent me a pack of these before and they were so, so nice. Um, so they're sort of pretzels. They're almost like crisp type things, but I don't know, they're really hard to describe, but they're so crispy and this flavor was so good. So it's uh, tomato and herbs. So I can see she sent me a couple of packets of these and I can't wait to eat them because they are so, so nice. Um, we can get some stuff like pretzels over here, but most of the ones I've tried have just been like salted, a little bit more boring. I like this one because it has so much flavor and it was just really good. So thank you for those, I love them. Oh, and I've just found a little note, so let's read that. This is so cute. So we've got um, sugar and sloth stationery. I know that I think Nicole maybe gets a subscription with that or she gets odd bits from there. Um, but it says, hi, Nadie, thank you for yet another awesome trade. Enjoy the new members of your toy family. Hugs, Nicole. And then you are awesome and deserve all the good things. <laughs> That's really cute. Thank you so much for this. I always keep these little notes. Uh, yeah, it's kind of like a toy family, isn't it? It's like we've adopted all of these people. We often say that like, oh, would you want to adopt this little one? Especially if they're like little animals or they've got faces. Um, but yeah, so next up we have got some super yummy chocolate. So really, really happy about these as well. We just call this the pink chocolate. But um, again, Nicole sent this to me once before. And then since then I was like, oh my gosh. So she always sends me a couple of bars of this. So, so nice. Um, so it's white strawberry crisp, absolutely lovely. So it's got little cornflake pieces in. It's just literally my favorite chocolate. I absolutely love this, so thank you. And then we have got one of these, which is really awesome. So um, Nicole spotted this in her local store and I had never had one of these before, but I do really love Sanrio and Hello Kitty. So I said, this would be a really awesome thing because um, we were just trying to find like some extra things to obviously swap and whatnot. So yeah, so these are called the Double Dippers. This is series one. Um, so yeah, really excited. I'll have to do a separate video on this one because I think you dip it in water and then um, it's gonna be like a Hello Kitty character and it gets like a little hat um, and an accessory. So that's really awesome. So yeah, really excited for that one. Oh, and we have a very cute little button here. Cute but fierce. I love that. That's really adorable. It's like this little dragon creature. So adorable. Thank you for that little extra surprise. I'll have to put that on one of my jackets or something. Really cute. I like that. I like the idea of being cute and nice, but still kind of having boundaries and, and being fierce if you need to be. And then we have one of these, which I might kind of just need to open now because I'm so obsessed with these. So these are the LOL Surprise Minis. Quite expensive over in Germany, so I really appreciate um, Nicole picking this one up for me. This is number three. I think I've pretty much completed my collection. I've got a lovely friend in America who's been finding these for me. I found some in a store. They took so blooming long to get here. Um, but by the time I found them, I think pretty much my American friend had got most of the ones I needed anyway. Um, but I picked up, I think I picked up like four of like the last ones I was missing. Um, but yeah, so this is one that Nicole found me. So this is really nice. I've got one from Germany. I'm gonna have a bunch from America. And then actually just a couple um, from the UK because apparently we're really slow at getting certain things in. 
Um, but yeah, let's just get straight into this because I really want to see what little animal this was. I was watching some videos and I think I kind of figured out which is which, but I kind of forgot, like I haven't actually memorized which number matches with animal because there's 18 different ones. So. so yeah, so this was number three. So let's have a look. So let's start with this little piece here. I always save the wrap in so I can package things. Oh, we have a little, I thought it was a bed, but I think it's a little chair. Very cute. Quite a long chair, it almost looks like a chaise lounge or something like that, kind of a posh chair. And then we have this piece here. Oh, okay, so this is just a single sort of wall piece. That's so cute, I love that scenery. So there's a little plane in the sky and palm trees. So this looks like it could be out of like a bathroom window or it could be from a balcony or something. I'm looking at like these little tiles. I can't wait to build the whole house. So I definitely have to do a video once I have the full set and that's gonna be so cute. So here is the checklist, very, very tiny, but here are all the different animals you can get. I love anything tiny and animal themed, so cute. I do love the big black eyes. Um, so yeah, so I'm assuming, well, we might have, it could be a bathroom one or it could be, oh, I think it could be a patio pal actually. So I think it's gonna be one of those three on there would be my guess because it looks like we have like a little patio chair and with that little bit of scenery there looks like it's outside so these do also come with like a little keychain and the little ball that you can connect together if you wanted to um, and then in here is going to be our animal let's have a look oh, oh my gosh it looks so cute it's so adorable it's a tiny little duck it's a gorgeous color i love that almost like teal color it's got a little like feathery bit on its head. That is so cute. So this is, oh, and here's the sticker for it as well. Really adorable. So this is like a little patio duck. So this little one can just kind of sit on the chair like that. Oh, so cute. Thank you so much. I love it. So this little duck is called Feathers. Um, and then you also get like these little cardboard bits which you could kind of build a little scene, which I suppose would work if you weren't collecting the full house. Um, that's quite cool with some cacti as well. So next in my lovely package, we have what looks like a bunch of these. Um, so Nicole was able to find me loads of these. I think they were possibly on clearance. I can't remember if she said that in her local store once again. Um, and she managed to find a bunch of the numbers I was missing. I think I'm only really missing one now. Um, I'll probably do a separate video on these actually as well, because there's four of them. Um, but yeah, thank you so much for finding me these. This is awesome. I love the fact that they're little stamps as well. So I could use that maybe in my journaling or something like that. So they're little cute figures, but they've also kind of got a function as well, which is awesome. And then we have a doll in here. So this was really exciting as well. So I've really been getting into Cave Club. Um, they're really cute dolls actually. I love their faces, but they, I kind of was a bit delayed with them because of the whole animal print thing, but they're actually really adorable dolls. And then they brought out this sleepover range. I love anything sleep themed. Um, so Nicole very, very sweetly said that I could have this one. Um, and she is gorgeous. I'm not gonna lie, I have forgotten her name. Um, no, it's completely gone. The only name I can remember out of all of them is Vanessa, which is um, probably because she's my favorite one. Um, but this one is so adorable. I love that she's got crimped hair. This little um, like eye thingy, I've forgotten words. What is this called? This little eye mask is so adorable. Their faces are just really cute. I love that they've got very sculpted, quite muscular looking um, like calves as well. I think that's awesome. Actually, all of their legs could look quite muscular. And I suppose that makes sense for like cavemen and women. They probably were very active and, you know, having to hunt for food and stuff, which is crazy. But yeah, I love this doll. She's gorgeous. Um, so I would definitely have to take some photos of all of my cave club dolls because I've got probably around five or so now. They're absolutely amazing. Um, and she comes with this really cute, I think it's like a little cushion, really adorable little dinosaur. Um, and then also this little popcorn accessory, which is so cool. I love popcorn. Nothing better than sitting in bed with a bit of popcorn and watching some films or something. Oh, and I just discovered this in the box. I think this would go with her as well. Um, so this is really cool. It's like a little lantern. I love the way the flame looks. It's actually slightly metallic. You can actually see when it hits the light. So nice, I really like the accessories with these dolls as well. Really, really lovely. And then we've got a super little fun bag full of goodies here. 
So I'm in love with this. So Nicole showed me this and she was like, oh, I just found this. So I think she said she already had some, you know, similar to this. And she was like, do you want this? And I was like, oh my gosh, yes, I love it. So it says vegan snacks and it's kind of like Polly Pocket style. And it's just gorgeous. So yeah, it's just like a little food container. Or I suppose you could just put jewelry in it or anything really just a little trinket box but i love it uh, i mean i feel like i probably should put food in it because it says vegan snacks so maybe when i go to work i could put i don't know some grapes in it or some biscuits or something but it's so adorable i love it thank you so much that's something really unique as well that i wouldn't be able to find myself probably and then next up we have a couple of cloudies. Now these aren't actually for me. Um, there's this other lovely lady who's in uh, the Netherlands, I believe. And I'm doing a trade with her and she's after, I think she was missing like two final cloudies from the latest series. I'm not fully up to date with all the series and stuff. Um, but she wanted this little Phoenix one, which is so adorable. These, the fur is very wispy on this one. I actually love that it's very glittery. That's really cool. This is much nicer in person than I was expecting this one, but this is for a friend. <laughs> So that was really nice of um, Nicole to actually include this in the trade um, so that I could pass this on to a different friend. I ended up doing the same with Nicole actually. We've got, um, there's a mutual friend of ours in America who Nicole's doing a trade with. And rather than the lady in America doing two separate trades, we thought that she would just do a trade with Nicole and then I sent some bits to Nicole to put in her box, if that makes any sense. Um, but yeah, this one comes with these little like flame sunglasses as well, very cute. Um, and then we have this like mermaid kitty one. Again, not super familiar with these, but this one seems to be holding a conch shell. Very cute. I do love the sort of translucent glitter effect of these. So I'll have to make sure that I put those uh, to the side for my other friend. Um, so then we do have an extra cloudy here and this one is for me. Um, this is one of the little minis, which is so adorable. This is, I think, from the Senti series. Um, so this is a little elephant, super cute. I love uh, the little storm cloud effect and it's got a little blue tail, very adorable. Oh, I can smell something actually. Oh, it has quite a sweet smell. That smells really nice actually. So I hope they all smell really good. I've got a few other of the Scenties ones that I still have to open. So really cute. Thank you for thinking of me when you found that one. And then in here we have some of uh, the Littlest Pet Shop Minis. I absolutely love the mini ones. I think I've done some videos on them before. They're so adorable. So first of all, we have uh, one of these little ring ones. And we have this tiny little like chipmunk or possibly squirrel. So adorable. I love its little face. It's got a little smile and it's kind of like a little acorn that goes on the top. I love these with their little like hideaways or oh, and you can take it off so it doesn't have to be on a ring. That's really cool. And then we have this one here, which is in like a little cage and I believe it's a little bird inside. Let me see. There we go. Oh, it's so cute. It looks just like Tweety. Like Tweety Bird, so cute. I love that little bird, adorable. I remember Nicole showed me these and she said that I could pick any that I wanted already because she knows that I collect the mini ones, so that was so nice. Um, and then this one, which I think um, my American friend Maggie will probably be jealous of this one if she sees it, um, but it's a banana themed one. Um, and inside we have a really cute little monkey. That's so adorable. I love this banana one. Um, hopefully I, if I find another one at one point, maybe Maggie can have one. <laughs> and then there's this one with the little present. I love the pastel colours of this one. And oh, this is cute. I think it's maybe a kitty. Really cute. Looks like a really kind of fancy kitten. So adorable. Thank you so much for those. Um, and a couple of other little bits. So I spotted these and I love these ones. I can't remember exactly what series these were from, um, but they're really nice. They've got little bits of glitter on the top as well. So this one I think is like a little ladybug or a little ladybird. Um, and then we've got this one is so tiny. I think it's maybe, it looks like it could be a kangaroo or a little bunny, little glittery ears. This one is so cute, I love them. Um, and then the last one is this gorgeous hot pink color. And I think this one's like a little moose. I love that they've all got like flowers on their head and translucent and glittery. They're just a little bit different, those ones. So nice. And then the last thing in this amazing package was kind of a, a sort of random thing that come up. Um, basically, Nicole brought a whole box full of these. Um, and I think she ended up with a few doubles. And she said, um, basically, did I want any? And I said, to be honest, I 
used to collect Nom Noms, but I wasn't really that familiar with this series. Um, but when she said she had a few doubles, I kind of researched what they were and they looked actually super cool. Um, so she's given me a couple of different ones. She allowed me to pick like my favorite sets, which was so sweet. Thank you for that. So I'll do a video on these as well, actually, um, because even though I know which ones they are, I obviously haven't opened them yet and really excited to actually have a proper look at these. Um, and I just think they're really interesting. So yeah, so these are the stackable slime kits. Um, yeah, they're just really adorable. So I can't wait to open those. This little cloudy smells so good. It just smells kind of like sweets and really, really nice. I can't stop smelling it. Um, but anyway, so that was everything in this amazing package from Nicole. Thank you so much again. I love everything. I feel like it's such a nice variety of items. I felt kind of bad because Nicole was mainly asking me to get her some of the mini brands. Uh, we have like the UK version over here and I got a bunch of those, but I kind of feel like that was mostly what was in her package, but obviously a couple of other things as well, but I really hope that she loves everything. Um, but yeah, thank Thank you so much for another amazing trade and thank you guys so much for watching as well please like and subscribe if you enjoyed the video and i'll see you in the next one bye